Hey there, and welcome to You Can Uke, where each week I'm releasing new song tutorials so that you can learn how to play the ukulele with success. So if you don't want to miss a lesson, then hit that subscribe button, like this video, and get ready to play Flightless Bird, American Mouth by Iron and Wine. Now before we play this song, we first need to make sure that our ukulele is in standard tuning of G, C, E, A. By the way, if you need help tuning your ukulele, then make sure that you check out my online ukulele tuner video. Next, there's four chords that we need to know in order to play this song, and those chords are C major, A minor, F major, and G major. If you know how to play those four chords, then great job. Feel free to skip ahead to the later portion of this lesson. So the first chord that we're going to learn is C major. To play that, just take your third finger and press down on the first string of the third fret. This is C major. The next chord is A minor. To play that, just take your second finger and press down on the fourth string of the second fret. This is A minor. The next chord is F major. To play that, just take your first finger, press down on the second string of the first fret, and then take your second finger and press down on the fourth string of the second fret. This is F major. And our last chord for this song is G major. To play that, take your first finger, press down on the third string of the second fret, take your second finger, press down on the first string of the second fret, then take your third finger and press down on the second string of the third fret. This is G major. Now we're going to learn the chord progression for this entire song. It's just going to be C major for 12 beats, A minor for 12 beats, F major for 12 beats, and G major for 12 beats. Let's play through that chord progression now by ringing out each chord. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Now we're going to learn the finger picking pattern for this entire song. And before I show you the pattern, I'm going to show you where you place your fingers on the strings. Your thumb, which is your first finger, is going to go on the fourth string. Your second finger, which is your index finger, is going to go on the third string. Your third finger, which is your middle finger, is going to go on the second string. And your fourth finger, which is your ring finger, is going to go on the first string. So your picking fingers should look something like this. One, two, three, four. And now we're going to learn the finger picking pattern, which goes something like this. One, two, three, four, three, two. Let's practice that finger picking pattern now on the C major chord. One, two, three, four, three, two. 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 And now let's apply the chord progression with that finger picking pattern. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, 12. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Now that we know the chords, the chord progression, and the finger picking pattern, let's put it all together with the lyrics and play through Flightless Bird, American Mouth. I was a quick wit boy, diving too deep for chords, all of your street light eyes, wide on my plastic toys, then when the cops Close the fair, I cut my long baby hair Stole me a dog-eared map And call for you everywhere Have I found you? Flightless bird Jealous We American mouth, big pill, looming. And at the end of the song, you're just going to down strum on a C major chord. Now, if you want to play through the rest of that song, 
then go down in my description box below and click on the link to access the chord chart. And that's how you play Flightless Bird American Mouth by Iron and Wine. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope it brings you success in learning how to play the ukulele. Again, don't forget to subscribe, and as always, keep practicing and keep playing because you can uke.